Show me the verse. Come on. Don't be shy. Show me the verse. Holy Bible. 1 Timothy chapter 2, verse 10. But which becometh woman, professing godliness with good works. So now it's going to show you a godly woman. Verse 11. Let the woman learn in silence, with all subjection. But I suffer not a woman to teach, nor to usurp authority over the man, but to be in silence. Now let's look up these words, yeah? In verse 10, the first word we're going to look up is the let the woman learn. Let, prolonged from a primary verb, another form of which Matthew is used as an alternative in certain tenses. To learn, in any way, learn, understand. This word, suffer. From and the base of, to turn over, transfer, that is, allow, give, leave, liberty, license, let, permit, suffer. That's where, teach, feminine, of, as, noun, stillness, that is, desistance from bustle or language, quietness, silence. Holy Bible, let's get it. This is to all the Negro women, the Native Indian women, and the Hispanic women, but mostly directed to the Negro women. Now, I realize on my post here, y'all keep on jumping on there trying to save the heathen blood. Every single time when man put a post out, you know what's funny? I'm just starting. I've got way more scriptures to prove to y'all that the heathens are not going to be saved, but in captivity, and after they will be set free, and the rest will go into the lake of fire. And the Gentiles that he's talking about is actually Hellenized Jews. I'm a Hellenized Jew. I'm speaking English right now. I'm living in a country that's not mine. But anyway, let's get to it. This is Jeremiah chapter 31 verse 22. How long will thou go about, O backsliding daughter? For the Lord had created a new thing in the earth. A woman shall come past a man. Don't think because y'all are getting better jobs, more money and shit. Don't think that y'all are some, so special. Listen to me. The Most High did this on purpose. And guess what? There's more women on the face of the earth than there is men. So if the whole earth blew up right now and you went and searched the dead bodies, you'd find more women. So who do you think is going in the lake of fire more? That's the reason why the Most High says in Isaiah chapter 4, seven women to one man. Because there's more of y'all. So the first word, etymology, backsliding, right? What does it say right there? It says this is heathenish. Or actually heathen. Backsliding, backsliding. So you're acting like a heathen. You're a heathen right now. You can't save them. Let the men lead in Israel now and shut your damn mouth. You are made to love and to only love. Men are made with logics. Y'all will give a killer love before y'all notice he's a damn killer. That's what y'all are doing with these heathens. So backsliding daughter, yeah? Pause and read. A new thing. A woman shall come past a man, yeah? Besiege us with your big mouth. Shut up and let us lead now, man. If you don't, the most I will just destroy you for us anyway. Pause.